Hi guys, today I'm going to explain the olfactory nerve, which is the first uh, pair of cranial nerves. It's actually easy, but it's easier for me to upload it on YouTube in order to revise it and make it more simple for myself. Uh, in order to start explaining about the olfactory nerve, we need to revise some fundamental important stuff. Uh, here's the medial side of the skull, and here's the ethmoidal bone with the crystagalli and the ethmoidal foramens. And here is the nasal, which is the nose. And as we know, these foramens connect this area with the nasal, like this. And to be more better viewed, actually, here, look. Here, in this part, the quaveria of the skull is removed, the upper part of the skull. And we are left from the lo for the lower part. Here is the cribriform which is the, the upper part of the ethmoidal bone and here are the foramens of the ethmoidal bone okay we are good now let's go to the important part now look this the whole thing here is the nasal mucosa and in the olfactory nerve there's three neurons the first neurons actually are located on the nasal mucosa look here they are bipolar sensory neurons they escapes through the ethmoidal bone through the <coughs> uh, ethmoidal foramina as we said of the cribriform part and they synapse look with the second bipolar neurons on the olfactory bulb look this the whole thing not the red i'm not talking about the red part i'm talking about the blue part is the uh, second neurons which are which synapse with the first neurons on here and the second neurons here they are located on the olfactory bulb and to be more specific for this picture olfactory bulb here this is the inferior brain surface and here is the olfactory bulb located on the olfactory sulcus here the olfactory bulb is cut and here is the continuation of the olfactory sulcus now we said the first neurons synapses with the second neurons on the olfactory bulb now the last part is the trigonum of the olfaction which is the uh, place where the third neurons are located which the second neurons synapses with the third neurons and you need to know that all of these are bipolar neurons sensory bipolar neurons now in the trigonum the third part the third neurons goes to the cortical center of olfaction which is oncus oncus and you uh, when you study more about cranial nerves you know you will know that there is cranial nerves that has cortical and subcortical centers for example like the uh, eyes the optic nerve but the olfaction only have cortical center which is the oncus and about the third part here the third neurons makes three strias lateral intermediate and medial they are all located and attached to the cortical part of the uncus here and I'm sure that we all know what what is uncus uncus is the upper part of the uh, half compass which is here look here this part so let's revise very fast as we know, it goes to the nose, to the cribriform foramina, then to the bulb, olfactory bulb, here, look, to the trigonum, then to the uncus, which is the central part. And as we said, the first neurons are located on the mucosa of the nose, then the second neurons are located on the olfactory bulb here, the third neurons are located here, on the trigonum of the olfaction. And as we said, there is three strias, lateral, medial, 
and uh, sorry lateral intermediate and medial um, they are all connected to the central cortical center of olfaction which is the uncus thank you very much oh and by the way uh clinical tip for you whenever we are having disorder in this nerve or or whenever we are injured this nerve is injured we might have something called anosmia anosmia is the absence of olfaction um it can be treated but later thank you very much